In this video, we're going to walk through licensing for the ASAV from the command line. As you might remember, I previously configured licensing through the vCenter template, but the management interface ended up not being routable, so the ASA could never connect to the Smart Licensing Cloud and verify that it was licensed. There are a few things you need to do in order to register your ASA to the Smart License Cloud. The ASA must have a route to the internet, the ASA must be able to use DNS, and there should be a Smart License token issued. Let's go ahead and start our configuration by configuring DNS. First, we'll specify that DNS lookups should originate on the inside interface. I'm going to go ahead and add my DNS server to the default DNS server group. In this case, it shows an error because it was added during the initial vCenter config, so we can go ahead and move on. I'm going to specify in my smart license config that this is a standard tiered license with a throughput level of 100 megs. Since my original smart license registration is hung due to timing out, I'm going to re-kick it off with the license smart register ID token force command. Now let's issue the show license summary command and see what happens. It looks like it's still not registered yet, so let's give it a second. Okay, it looks like it's finally registered, and that's all I wanted to show you with this video. Thanks for tuning in.